Mike from Bird Days and Net. I'm back and we're outside in a ventilated area and I've set up the uh, house in an appropriate spot that I can spray paint. I actually made a little plug to keep the door shut. I keep the door shut from spray paint going in and I have my little turnstile here and we're going to go ahead and give it a good coat of paint. So without any further ado, start on the side. Yeah, there we go. All right, move it along. An old can of paint seems to be working fairly good. Uh, hopefully, I won't be speaking out of turn. Now, this wood's going to suck this paint right up. So, I might want to put a second coat on later on. Now, moving away with the nails, I'm able to get to the back of the house and pretty much get every last little spot. Give a look, see here. Keep that door shut. And I'll give it a shot underneath. And I, after this dries, I can get any little mist spot. I'm merely moving it around after it's off the platform. Well, that's a good first coat, or it's a first good permanent coat. Nice green box. When it dries, it'll be protected and give some character around your house, especially if you have a green house. Anyway, we'll have uh, other videos to talk about how we can two-tone this by masking off different areas, spraying after it dries, you mask off the sprayed areas, and then you spray different colors and do different decorations on the box. Anyway, see you later.